Hi guys! Apologies for the lighting. It's actually like 5 p.m. right now. I'm really sorry. Uh, it is June 14th. Welcome to the vlog. I am really <laughs> starting it late. It's been a busy day. I went to work with my dad and we just had a lot to do and then I had to swing by like a tire place because there was a nail in one of my tires and they had to get it out. But now I'm here, got my wet hair, <laughs> ready to go out to dinner. Me and my mom are meeting up with my cousin and my aunt and going to Rock Bottom. Oh my god you guys, I love Rock Bottom so much. I thought it was just in Milwaukee, but there's one like by me and I'm pumped because it's literally my favorite restaurant. And my cousin Amy is the same age as me, so we both graduated college this year. So we're just going out to celebrate and hang out. I'm not sure if I'll vlog at dinner, but I am definitely gonna open my Ipsy bag tonight just to make this vlog a little longer and to give it some content because clearly I'm starting it right now. So don't worry, I'll talk to you more later, but for now, I'm gonna head out to dinner. Give us some entertainment. Cool Can shirt. I left my shirt. It's like a peacock. I did try to fly today at work. I got caught. <laughs> um, okay. All right. I got off my, I got up out of my chair to walk around, you know, stretch my arms and I went like this and my boss caught me. She goes, you trying to fly? I'm like, yeah, I'm learning. What go. a fun day. Oh, here it comes. Rain. Open the blinds. You won't be able to see it. Get the light. Wow. <laughs> Hopefully it won't be too bad, but yeah, there's reds. Reds and oranges. First of all, we'll do this later. Second of all, this package was on the doorstop. Doorstep, not doorstep. <laughs> so it's my birthday on Friday, duh, and it's Father's Day on Sunday, duh. So my sister, hi Evie, hi, hi, hi. She sent us a package, <laughs> half for dad, half for me, and this is my card. Look at this, she made it. Handmade with love by Evelyn. Very nice. I'm gonna read it, I swear, but for the vlog, I wanna open this. So okay. let's see what we got. These are freaking amazing. Yes. I'm surprised she remembered I like them. <laughs> I haven't had them in so long. It's your sister. Oh my oh. gosh, a two pack. Wonder balls. I've never seen two packs. This man. is amazing. Oh my God, Ooh. brownie mix mm. with chocolate chips. I'm heard of. I think these are chocolate covered Oreos. Cause we would sell them at TJ Maxx and they came like this in a pack. Oh wow. I think. But we'll then she kept some, huh? Yeah. <laughs> Three face masks ah. by I'm Real. Skin soothing, brightening, and clear skin. I should use one of these tonight cause my skin's not nice. Right <laughs> and I think the last thing on my side oh. is a, ooh! Candle? Yeah! Yeah. Smells so good. Coconut colada. Mm. Candle. And I'm gonna peek on dad's side. He That's has dad's half. Candy, oh, oh. little gummies. Oh, his and favorite. Caramel oh, yeah. Yowza. And look, his name, Henry. Oh, Henry. Oh, that's funny. <laughs> Wait, I want to. And he likes my knights. Oh, she didn't make him a card. <laughs> I got a handmade card and he did. What does it say? Thank you. For being the best dad a girl could have. Sorry, Aww. we're not reading this. What? <laughs> How fun is that? Thanks, Abby. Come on. That's it. <laughs> Hi, guys. I said I would open my Ipsy today and I wasn't lying. I'm going to do that. And I'm also going to show you what's in my Sephora play. I just figured why not open up all my mail at once and make this like a mail vlog. So let's dive into the Ipsy. This is the bag this month. It's just a, a mouth on a, on a bag. I don't know. The first thing in here is a Trust Fund Beauty nail polish and I have gotten one of these before. It was a brownish color and I did not care for it. I liked the formula of the nail polish but the color just was not my thing. And then I pull this out and I'm like, holy crap. This is in the color Game Changer and it is so neon, so electric. It's a, it's a pinky orange I would say like neon. I don't know if you can even tell how neon this is, but holy crap. It's super fun for summer, I will say that, but um, I'm a little afraid. <laughs> I do like when I get nail polish in my Ipsy's though, because obviously it's something that I use all the time. Next thing I pulled out is this Peak, P 
Kiku, what, wait, what does this say? Black Primer. I was really confused by it. It came in this little package and then it's this little tin like this. First of all, it's super hard to open. I had to have my mom open it the first time I looked at this. So it's just this black cream sort of stuff and it is supposed to be an eyeshadow primer for darker eyeshadows. So if you want to make your dark shadows pop, you put this on underneath. I don't know. I'd rather just use a normal eyeshadow primer and I have really oily eyelids so a lot of primers don't work for me so I just like have this feeling this isn't gonna work but I guess it's worth trying at least once. Next up we have the NYX Whipped, just says whipped, it's a lip thing. It's in the color Pink Cloud. I did a swatch of it on my hand and I wasn't super impressed but I'll try any lip product one so I'm sure I'll try it. I mean it's just your average like pink. Next is the Delectable triple moisture body lotion in coconut and cream this is really nice actually it's just a lotion that smells like coconut and I can never get enough hand lotion I use it like probably every hour of my day so this is nice I will use this and then the last thing in here is the pure fully charged mascara and I'm really curious about this because it says powered by magnetic technology I have no idea what that means um, it looks like your average mascara. Let me try to open it. This is what we got. It's a mascara wand. I love mascara. I really do. So <laughs> I'm obviously going to try this as well. I should just do a video of me like trying all of my Ipsy or Sephora products. Probably next month when I'm not vlogging. Maybe I'll try to do that. So that was my Ipsy. Now let's move on to Sephora Play. This is the summer bag and I did go through this already and I was not impressed. You'll kind of see why after I show you everything. The perfume sample this month was the Derek Lamb 10 Crosby Blackout. I, I have no idea. Um, this smells like one of those perfume pamphlets you get in magazines and you smell them and they're nice because you're like, oh, perfume in a magazine. This is fun to smell. But realistically, you would never wear it that's this. It's just super intense, super strong. I can't picture myself wearing this. The first actual product in here are these um, Dr. Dennis Gross, lots of words, self tanner for face. This is terrifying, okay? First of all, I don't self tan. I just, I'm afraid I'm going to turn orange. I, I've never done it, so I just don't really know how it works. And I just think it's super strange they would send me self-tanners for my face. Like, they just assume your body is self-tanned, but your face is super pale, so you need to self-tan only your face. I don't really understand that. And I'm not going to use this. <laughs> it's nice they send you, like, three, I guess, because these are pretty small and, like, one-time use only things. But it's not a product I'm going to use. I did think, I was joking with my mom, I was like... My feet are super white compared to my legs because when I go on long walks outside, obviously like gym shoes and socks, so your feet just stay super pale. I'm like, maybe I'll try using them on my feet to even out the tan of my legs and see if they work. Next, I have the Tarte Tarte Guard 20. This is a tinted moisturizer with SPF. I don't use tinted moisturizers, honestly. I like if I'm gonna wear makeup or something tinted, I'm gonna wear foundation because my skin isn't good, so I need the coverage of a foundation. Maybe if it blends well onto my skin and I want a really natural makeup look that day with SPF, I would reach for this, but I just can't see myself using it. I like this Tarte though. I like Tarte products a lot. Next is the Bumble and Bumble Don't Blow It um, Hair Styler. And I was reading the little pamphlet. It said this is just like a hair cream that makes it look like you blow dried your hair and like you really got a blowout, you have super nice hair or whatever. I don't believe that. I don't really know how a cream can make your hair look that good, but I guess I'll try it. I don't know. These are all like really small samples this month too, I'm not gonna lie. Like Ipsy gave me this whole freaking tube of hand lotion, you know what I mean? Okay, next thing in Sephora Play is the Brio Geo Curl Charisma Leave-In Defining Cream. This actually smells really nice. This is probably my favorite product in the bag. Not like I've whoops, used any of this, but I, I will use this. It's just like a leave-in conditioner you can use in the shower or maybe, I don't know. Oh yeah, do not rinse. Okay, it's not a conditioner. Wow, I should read things more often. But yeah, it smells nice, so I'll use this. I just use things that smell nice. That's all I care about with hair products. 
And then the last thing in here is this Kat Von D liquid lipstick. I love these, okay? I have a mini of the Lolita, and I love the formula of these, but... I pulled out this color, again, my lighting isn't super great right now, so I'm not sure if you could tell, but this is like a bright magenta, and it is not a color I would go for. I get summer, you can like wear really bright pinks and purples and stuff on your lips, but this is just not a color I would go for. So while I like Kat Von D, I wish this was a different color. So as you can see, a little disappointed. Definitely Ipsy won this month. It's not, I mean, it's not a competition. I don't really <laughs> compare them that often because I'm pretty pleased with Ipsy and Sephora Play, both, like, in the month. That's why I continue to order both of them. But I think Ipsy has more promising products this month. Now that I have blabbed on for years and years, we're going to end the vlog with our question of the day. The question for June 14th is, did you exercise today? Man, the one day that I don't is the day that it asks me. Realistically, I didn't have time today and my legs still kind of hurt, so it probably wouldn't have been good if I exercised today, but my Q&A day book just make me feel bad about myself, dang. Okay, that's it for this vlog. I hope you liked it. I know I didn't really do that much, but I got a lot of things off my to-do list. Like this Ipsy has been sitting in my room for a week and I haven't opened it, so. Uh, thumbs this up, thumbs this up. I feel like, sh what does that mean? Give this video a thumbs up, leave some comments down below, and subscribe. I will see you guys tomorrow for a very exciting vlog. Just get ready for the vlogs this weekend, you guys. You're not ready. I'm not ready. I am ready. I'm very excited. I'm going to Milwaukee for my birthday. I told you this. It's fine. Get ready for these vlogs. My car is all set, I think. My dad is fixing a headlight right now, I want to say, but I have new brakes. I have insurance, so we're gonna go on this road trip to Milwaukee. I'm so excited. Ah. I love birthdays. I love my friends. I love Milwaukee. I love driving. Okay, that'll be tomorrow. Stay tuned. I'll see you then.